In this video, we will show you the approved method for splicing your CAN bus signal wires. Hi, this is Chris from Garmin. Now that we've prepared our harness for wire splicing, we can take our splices, our lead wires, and our splice wires and bring them all together. Start with our splice and our lead wire. Again, making sure that we have full penetration. We can see in the window in the center the spliced wire is there. Then we grab our crimping tool, lining it up with the proper color coding, and then applying the crimp. We can see once removed, the wire still appears in the window and ready for our next steps. Depending on the length of your lead wire, you may prefer to push your sleeve over the other two to begin with. Helps hold them in place, gives you a cleaner workspace. Again, ensuring both wires push through and are seen in the window. We then put them in the tool and execute our crimp. We can see here we've got maximum engagement, and when we cover it all up, we're ready to apply our heat. Now while we applied our heat, we moved it around to apply it evenly so we didn't burn or discolor the sleeve. You can see we fully melted both ends, therefore providing us with that environmental seal. If you would like to see the next step in the process, please refer to our follow-on video, Connector Assembly.